I studied journalism at university and then I found a job working in a food magazine in Sydney. I was invited to a PR event for venison and I went along and there was this handsome farmer there and that was Tim and um, we met and three months later we were engaged. I just quit my job and <laughs> moved to the farm. Within sort of a year and a half I was having a baby and my life was completely different. I work as well, I, I do a bit of my own freelance work and I do our website and a bit of marketing and stuff for the business. And the kids absolutely keep us busy. One of our children, Alice, is in kindergarten and my son Tom is at preschool a few days a week. Every spare second seems to be swallowed up by something. Tom particularly has got some kind of magnetic attraction to mud. I would say he has about three or four changes of clothes every day. I've always been interested in food, and for me it's where you buy your food and how you source your food is just as important as how you cook it. We truly believe in the whole nose to tail philosophy. I like to cook with the kids as much as possible. We cook with meat a lot. We have to be very aware of making sure we don't have any cross-contamination in the cooking process. It's, it's the best thing ever, parenthood. I can't imagine um, life without them. Lots of little things, I think, make it worthwhile when they say they enjoyed their dinner. When they eat their dinner, that's always exciting. <laughs> when they come up to you and wrap their little arms around your neck and tell you that they love you. and um, Little things like that, I think, are beautiful. And that's what makes me go or turn all jelly inside and turn to Tim and say, let's have another one. <laughs> Share the little things you do for health at missionforhealth.com.au.